Out. The next tip is uh, try and use sync codes if you can. Sync codes mean that you can sync your transcript line by line with your media sources in your project for that particular transcript. So uh, here's the Lego demo project, which we've already added many sync codes. Uh, what I'm going to do is delete one of them and then show you how we can add one as we're moving along. So here we are at this point here, which I'm just going to play. Hey, so. so that one is the sync, the sync code that shows us the beginning of Traito in Go in Danish with the translation. So that's giving us, when I click that, we go straight to that point. And we can move those around. For example, I can uh, move them. Uh, hey. Let's just move it to here. Hey. Yeah. So you can hear I'm moving it. Hey. There, we've just clipped it. So it's roughly about there. So that's that sync code. Now, if I, well, I didn't have any sync codes, if I you know, had just typed the transcript, um, um, then I could go back through the whole transcript and add sync codes for every line. Now, that's a bit painstaking. Why not just do, as you type lines, then every, every few lines you can add a new sync code, which means you can go back quickly to any point and then start adding more sync codes. So I find a good strategy is, is uh, lace a few sync codes as you go along and then use those to go back and then fill in the gaps to more and more detail as you see appropriate. So let's just say here, I want, if I right click on this, I can actually delete the sync code. So I'm going to delete that one, which is now gone. And let's say I'm here and uh, I've just typed what this here and now I'm I'm getting to this point. Uh, I think that's that's it says this, but I haven't added a sync code. So what I need to do is just play. Yeah. And you can hear yeah. there's a lot of noise going on from other people talking in the background. So it's not there's a bit of interference here. It's not a completely silent. Yeah. And there it's roughly around here. And if I just move the cursor or I can actually uh, go back frame by frame or I can jump uh, around. I'll just go back again and mess that up. Yeah. It, it, it's coming up to here. If you just want to see about moving a frame, then it's uh, Control, Alt and J. So there you can see I'm moving backwards and forwards. Uh, I've gone a little bit too far maybe. If I just press the Shift and uh, Control and, and Space, you see I'm not hearing it yet. So if I play, there I'm a bit too early. I can just go back a frame. And then if I use the shift again with with the play sequence, play, play, play. that's probably about right. Could be just one frame before. Play. So let's say I want it there. Uh, then I can just go either I can click here and add it and there will be one. Um, you have to be on the right line if you want to click it here. But uh, if I want to do it here, then I could just click there. There's the clock icon comes up and I click and there it appears. And then I can uh, Move that around just to get it exactly where I want. Let's say just there. Hey. Uh, and that's the beginning. So there I've added. And if I was, as I was typing the transcript, if I kept adding sync codes like that, and you, if you do con con Control M or Command M, you'll insert a sync code exactly at the line you're on. So you don't even have to lift your keys and move your mouse. It, as long as you've got the playhead at the right point, and then you press. Uh, Control or Command M, it will insert for the current line you're on a sync code. And I can just show you that here. Delete that. Let's say we're at this line here. This is the line that we're currently editing. What I can do is just press Control M, and there you see there's the sync code. So try and use sync codes, and if you do that routinely, keep adding them uh, using a shortcut. It's extremely fast, and then you'll be able to jump around. As you see here, I can jump around anywhere I want using either the editor or the timeline to jump around uh, inside the transcript exactly to hear what I need. Uh, there we are. End of tip.